hi guys welcome back to my channel so in today's video we're going to be creating corn dogs we're going to be making this recipe you guys have been asking me about it i've talked about it i think in two of my videos and you keep asking me for when are you going to show us this corn dogs video so today i want to show you how to make it so grab your pen your paper and get ready to make corn dogs with me so in case you're coming across my channel for the first time my name is furo i'm a potter cut nigerian based youtuber i create motherhood content recipes and i also vlog my life as a mom of three living in port harcourt nigeria so if that sounds like what you want to keep up with please hit that subscribe button turn on your notification bell and give this video a thumbs up and most importantly, don't forget to leave your thoughts and your comments in the comment section. So without further ado, let's get into the video. So the ingredients we are going to be using is granulated sugar. Um, we are also going to be using milk. You can use liquid milk or powdered milk, but I didn't have any liquid milk, so I'm using powdered milk for this video. And I also leave all the ingredients in the description box below. We're also going to be using salt. Um, a teaspoon of salt will be fine, but if you don't have a teaspoon like this, you can use your eye to eyeball it, okay? So that's not a problem. We're also going to be using egg. Please, guys, be careful. Use a very fresh, fresh, fresh egg. We're also going to be using hot dogs. So I use the hot dogs, the packet one. I think this one is 12. There's 12 hot dogs in the packet. So I use the packet one. You can use the packet one. You can use the one with the can. It depends on your choice. But I think the packet one are more fresh and more juicy. So if you want to get, get the packet one. We're also going to be using Skiwi. Yeah, so Skiwi is um, this um, bamboo sticks that they use for kebab or for anything. Uh, meat to stick meat or stick fruit. You can get this um, bamboo sticks in your local shop. But if you can't find the bamboo stick, you can use toothpick. Yeah, you can use toothpick. We're also going to be using a teaspoon of baking powder. So this is my baking powder. You can use any brand of your choice. It doesn't matter as long as it is a baking powder. We're also going to be using some all-purpose flour. Yes, this is the cup I used to measure it. I measured three of this cup here. Yeah. So you can use like any cup you want to use, but this is the cup I use in measuring three of it. So I, I had to measure these things so that you guys can get the measurement and do this stuff appropriately and then i'm just going to sieve my flour to take away all the lumps all the things or wanted things that can be in this flour and then i'm done so i'm going to transfer it into a bigger bowl because that bowl was obviously small i'll add my sugar add all my dry ingredients together so that's the milk um adding my salt right now and then i'll add my baking powder and I'll just whisk all the dry ingredients together. It's a very easy recipe, not difficult to make, very easy. So I'll just whisk all my dry ingredients, whisk, 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 whisk. <laughs> just keep whisking, whisking to make sure everything is dissolved. Then you add your egg right now, and then I'm going to add some water. So, and I'll just whisk everything together. So just keep watching. <laughs> your your batter shouldn't be too liquidy or too solid and you're done so i'll just share my um skewer into two just to you know economize with the whole skewer business i don't want it to get finished <laughs> but if you have excess you can use one for each but um if i break it like this it enables me put it straight into the pot and also save some skewer for another day so let's just keep going Just get a long glass like this and transfer your butter into the glass 
this will make the dipping easier so all you want to do is just dip your hot dogs into the batter and just roll it like that to make sure that the whole body of the batter is the whole body of the corn dog is covered with the batter properly and then you fry in your deep oil